So if you're watching this video, um, that means that the Sam Simon is no longer a secret. The thing that springs to mind uh, that makes the vessel so special is uh, the fact that it was once owned by the Japanese government. Uh, the ship was used for the JARPA program, which is the, uh, which is the Japanese whaling program. This, this vessel was indeed once part of the Japanese whaling fleet. What we've gotten here is a, a 56 meter ship, uh, which is almost brand new and uh, can fulfill all the requirements of speed, range, that would give us confidence to head to the Southern Ocean. Now, part of the reason Paul asked me to explore the idea of purchasing this ship was the fact that there would be a psychological aspect to owning a vessel that had been owned once by the, by the whaling fleet. So when it is down in the Southern Ocean and the whalers see that there's a, a crew of anti-whaling activists on board, maybe that'll hit home psychologically the fact that uh, they're fighting a losing battle. For Operation Zero Tolerance, I would like to see a zero quota, meaning uh, the Japanese whaling fleet goes home to Japan without having killed a single whale. Uh, that is our goal this year, and uh, we're well prepared. We've got four ships, we've got every, every possible chance to uh, find the fleet early on and shut them down before they even get to the Southern Ocean.